Yeah, you see it. Bonus. Bonus. I'm on crook. Early morning, chicken, get that bag right. Money talking for me, know exactly what that cash like. Counting all this pepper minutes, gonna be a long night. Gassing on these bitches, got them blowing like the peace spot. Break it down the switches, tell these bitches miss it. Money always on the move, so we gotta get it. G Easy, Cardi B, bitch, there ain't no limits. Playing with my money, we gon' turn this into murder season. Niggas always tripping, I don't need a reason. Blast file, you gon' die over all the trees. Marinated overnight, bitch, I'm well seasoned. And it's probably in your dreams if I'm ever sleeping. No lacking two C's, bitch, I'm too well. What up, you two? The Amity Villain, Stick Size Soldier, Nameless Collected, I'm back again. And I'm finally taking a look at the Marvel Legends Akomi Wave. It's a pretty pretty sweet wave, pretty decent wave. I'm going to tell you, I, I took so long to do it because of the movie. I've seen the movie a couple times now, and it's a fantastic movie. All hell, King Kill manga. Um, pretty decent set of figures. Pretty decent set of figures. So let's get this countdown going. We know how this goes. Coming in at number six, we got Namor the Submariner. And, you know, I'm not the hugest fan of swimming guys wearing green shorts. Shorts. <laughs> um, you know, but he's pretty accurate. I'll give him that. He looks like he should for a classic, classic Namor, classic Submariner. I cannot lie. It's very uh, off base from the movie, but, you know, whatever. It's all good. They got to fill spots, and he's a good spot filler. He, I do like the Trident. The Trident looks very nice. The Trident is nice. And this is a... Uh, this is engraved. This is all detail, and this is not painted. This is, I guess, a solid, but, you know, whatever. Sorry. Yeah. Here's the alternate head. It's a pretty nice head. Yeah. <laughs> It's a pretty good looking head scope. Uh, yeah, it's cool. Can't get, I, I can't be mad at this head scope. It comes with a pair of alternate hands for swimming. Dive. <laughs> so there he is, number six, Namor. Coming in at number five, sadly for me, is going to be Black Bolt. I was excited to finally have a Black Bolt because I don't have one. But. Honestly, he's just on the bucky cap mold. He doesn't really come with much of anything. No hands, no accessories to make it seem like he's actually using his powers. None of that. But it's good to have finally a, a black bolt because now I have his queen. <clears throat> I have his queen here and I can start building my inhumans. I've had her in the box forever. I was just waiting to get my hands on him. So now they're open. So, coming in at number five, Black Bolt. Coming in at number four, we got this new style of Iron Man. It's pretty cool. I actually kind of like him. I went ahead and picked up two. That's why he has two blasters and two blasters there on his hands. Because, you know, I thought it was... It was decent enough. It was worth it to have that. So like I said, he's pretty cool. He's nothing too spectacular. I'm not like a... I'm not collecting a bunch of different Iron Man suits. I don't have time. Let's take a look at some of his accessories. And he comes with this really nice head sculpt. A very, I guess, handsome, young-looking Tony Stark. And, you know, pops right on there very nicely. Comes with these pair of hands that, you know, shoot the blast beams. and That's cool. But just for a closer look at this guy, I think it looks nice. There's another one from the Infinity Wave. I do have that one. I'm not impressed with that one at all. But this one, I do like, and I think I will be keeping. Of course. So, Iron Man coming in, surprisingly, at number four. Filling in my number three spot, we got Nakia, and as you can see, I have two of her, which I'm actually going to pick up a third so I can have two with the spares and just try to get some extra head sculpts for the troops and leave her as is in the suit as well. 
but you know she'll be standalone. But I do need to pick up a third. Uh, I like the imprints of the pants and everything. Fantastic character in the movie. Fantastic movie. Uh, you know, so this is just something I'm doing until I get a third. And these are technically her accessories. These little spare weapons she used to rock in the movie. And this week, you know, everything, everything came out really, really good. All the detailing, they really did, they really did a thing. I hope they could have fixed that a little bit with the hair, but it's fine. Uh, like I said, I'll probably try to hunt down a couple more head sculpts and switch them out. Great pattern. Great, great looking costume. Great figure. Great character. So she's coming in at the number three spot. Nakia. Ah, I wonder did you see my number two being the Black Panther? Now I picked the Black Panther because of several different reasons. Uh, let's start with some accessories. First up is his fist. He has a pair of fists. Fine, they're just a pair of fists. No big deal. Next up is the head scope. Uh, the unmasked head. Now, I'm sorry. This, to me, I'm sorry. This does not look like Chaswick Bozeman. It looks like a very nice detailed face of some black guy. But Chaswick Bozeman, I don't... I don't really see it. I'm sorry. I don't know. I could be the odd man out here, but uh, yeah. I think even Chaswick Bozeman would agree this doesn't really look like him. Like, first of all, you're way too light-skinned. What is that? I don't know. The complexion is all wrong. I guess if I squint and hold it at certain angles, it kind of looks like him. The articulation, they have well improved, but I'm still smitten. I'm still smitten by how the original Black Panther figure look. It just, the way it, the way it's just, it just looks buffer. It looks nicer. It looks cooler, in my opinion. But this one, yes, it does have much better articulation and all that there. Um, yeah. So I still like this one. So for me, this is kind of ugly, but well improved. I'll give them that. Well, well improved. And just for another comparison, real quick, let's get his sister out here. She's looking cool. She's looking like she's ready to tick that mantle with my X-Men belt. Thanks for coming out. So, yeah. So, Black Panther here is going to be my number two spot filler. Oh, yeah. That's right. Coming in at the number one spot, King Killmonger. All hell, King Killmonger. I opened this figure immediately when I got it. He was the only one in the entire wave that I actually opened for like two, three months. I've had the wave. And I finally opened the wave like a week before the movie. Or maybe not even a week, a few days before I actually saw the movie. And I understand why. I love this character. Michael B. Jordan, hands down, plays the best villain since Heath Ledger played the Joker. So, love this figure. I love the mold. The mold looks sweet. I love, of course, being a Black Panther, he has to have the hand claws. So he's got the pair of clawed hands. That's sweet. As you can see here, he has a pair of gripping hands. So he can grip his weapons that he defeated the king in combat. And I just, I really do like this figure. The head scope is insane. All that detailing. This looks really nice. The build is a lot different from his. And it, it, this one, I always liked it. I always liked it. And I, now that I've finally seen the movie, finally seen the movie, I love that figure. So, yeah, he's coming in at number one. And oh, just for a quick comparison, just because he's out here, and I don't want to waste the shot. Here he is next to the claw, whom he brought to justice. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, that's what he looks like stacked up against claw. And there he is at the number one spot. And finally, taking a look at the Builder figure, the Okomi Builder figure, which I don't remember the actress's name, but Michonne, she, as always, killed it, did her thing. I mean, she really, her character, wow. I was really, 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 really impressed how much butt she kicked. She was very, 
she was a soldier for real. She's a for real soldier. She killed it. She's a general. That's why she got the gold and the rest of them got this. You know, if you've seen the movie, you know what's up. But yeah, great job. Great job. I absolutely cannot give props enough to the actors in this movie. Everybody killed it. It was just a phenomenal, phenomenal movie. So let's take a quick look at her armor. Spin that around. And look at all this detail. And I absolutely love it. The costumes are great. Everything about it's great. Pretty bald head. Got a staff going. You know? So let's get her in the widest stance. And let's all go home. So there she is. Widest stance possible. For both feet flat on the floor. See if we get it down a little lower. She kicks some extreme butt. Good enough for me. Nameless collector, stick side, peace out. Fuck your integrity, fuck your pedigree, fuck your feeling, fuck your culture, fuck your mom, fuck your family, fuck your drive, fuck your land, fuck your children, fuck your lives. Who am I? Not your father, not your brother, not your reason, not your future, not your comfort, not your reverence, not your glory, not your heaven, not your angel, not your spirit, not your message, not your freedom, not your people, not your neighbor, not your baby, not your equal, not the title. Y'all want me under? I hear King Kill my God. Red light, green light, red.